So look, today's video topic is get with women who like you. Okay, very important video. So I'm going to be talking specifically to my men. Get with women who like you, bro. Right? Now in this life, we've all done this shit before. We all went on our way to try to get with a female who just didn't like us. Like she just wasn't feeling us for whatever the fuck the reason was. Maybe because we just ain't shit. Maybe because we just didn't look attractive. Now, I don't know about you. I always look handsome as fuck. 2017, 16, 18, 19, bitch, I promise you. <laughs> Dime on time, right? But aside from that though, get with women who like you, bro. You feel me? A lot of us men waste our time on women who don't like us. Right? A lot of us waste our time on women who don't like us, bro. Stop wasting your time and chasing women who don't like you, right? Get with women who desire you, who crave you, who want to be with you. I, it's that simple. I want you to know something. As a man, every woman is not going to like you. Right? Every woman is not going to like you, and that's okay. You're a man. If you're a man of value, who gives a fuck, man? Right? But a lot of y'all aren't a man of value or worth, so you don't have other options. You feel me? So when one woman or a couple women don't like you, you get so pissed and frustrated because you have no holes or you don't have any options in your life, bro. But when you're a man of value or you're a man who is going to have value in the long run, so you ain't gonna care if a bitch say, oh, I don't like you because you got other women who do like you and you gonna go fuck with them. Fuck the whole who don't like us. That's her loss, bitch. I'm a god, I'm a king, I'm a goat. That's how you gotta start thinking. When you a man of value, worth, when you building your life up, you don't give a fuck if a bitch don't like you. What the fuck? Bitch, you missing out. You dumb as fuck. You missing out on the, a divine masculine man. That's how I see it. So, legitimately, oh, legitimately, G, you gotta get with women who like you, bro. If she don't like you, she don't like you, G. That's the end of it, bitch. Well, I know you ain't probably got no hoes, bro. Can't get no hoes because you a bum. You a low life. You look, God, what's good, God? You a bum, bro. You a low life. You ain't in the gym. You ain't in shape. You ain't sexually appealing. You a beta cuck. You give off feminine energy to women anyway. You have no purpose. You just here loafing. Uh, can I get your number? Uh, uh, can I get your IG? She looking at you. She like, what the fuck? Who is you? You feel me? You ain't nobody. And you ain't finna be nobody. Women are very powerful. They can tell when a man is about to be something. Phenomenal. Great, great man. Great, powerful leader, right? But they don't see that in your dumb ass. So listen, get your shit together. Level up, man. Evolve, better yourself. As a man, the most high design is to constantly move forward and better ourselves and elevate and get to the next level. So if we are not doing that, it's a problem. Every man should be getting better every single day. At least 1% better every single day. That's what I do every single fucking day. I don't know how to stop getting better. All I know is to self-improve, 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 right? So in this life, every woman is not going to like you and that's okay. You have other women who do like you. You just fuck with the women who really like you. Okay, you can't expect every woman to like your dumb ass. Who gives a fuck, man? You know you a handsome ass nigga, right? <laughs> you know you in the gym, you know you healthy, you know you sexy, right? Who gives a fuck? That hoe missing out. We don't need that hoe. It's a badder bitch than hoe who like us, who trying to do right by us, you feel me? That's the mentality you gotta develop, but a lot of y'all got this low-level, weak, beta cuck scent mentality because you are a fucking bum or you're in the process of becoming a fucking bum. You have no purpose, right? You are undisciplined, you are feminine, you aren't masculine, you are not in the gym with your life, bro. So you don't get that much hoes anyway. So when you try to go out your way to get a hoe, she doesn't like you, but you still try to pursue her and try to convince her. She listen, once a woman doesn't like you, there's no convincing her, bro. Right? But you can't convince her if you level up and improve, G. So it's not the fucking end. If a woman don't like you right now, okay, cool. She probably don't like you because you don't got your shit together. You don't have your purpose, right? Or you don't have a purpose. You're not in the best shape of your life. You are sexually unattractive. You have a lot to work on as a man in this life. I got a lot. Of, I got a lot. I need to work on still, and I'm being humble about it, bitch. I'm working day in, day out. But this is just the beginning for me. I have been evolving. I am a man. I'm a god. I know I'm a god. I'm a divine man, right? I got a lot of work to do too. So I'm always improving, right? So when you are improving in this life, bro, there's gonna be women that like you, but then there's gonna be women who don't like you for whatever the reason is, but you don't give a fuck anyways because there's always gonna be more women who like you than don't like you. When you're a man improving, when you're a divine masculine man like me, there's always gonna be more women who like you 
then don't like you, right? So, as a man, right, if you got a lot of women who don't like you, it's because they see something in you that is horrendous, disgusting, unattractive, uh, not sexually appealing, you have no purpose, you're probably a demon. I told you, these women during these times can see who the angels are, who the humans are, and who the demons are. Notice I said three different things because everybody is not like me, everybody is not an angel, everybody is not uh, like me and you. Certain people are demons, certain people are regular people. So women can see everybody for who they are because women are a direct reflection of the cosmos. They have a heightened intuition than a man, right? As a man, you got to build your intuition up, right? It takes a lot of meditations, discipline, uh, spiritual practices, spiritual work, crystals, all types of shit to develop your intuition. So it's not too many men like me. And I am an angel, so I naturally have an advantage over demons and humans, okay? Cold truth. It's a goddamn honeybee buys, dude. I know I'm chosen because the honeybee symbolizes hard work, dedication, ethics. You see what I'm saying? But look, aside from that, man, it's okay if a woman don't like you, right? But during these times, right, I'm starting to realize that women can see everybody for who they are, right? So a lot of y'all are so fucked up and wicked. A lot of y'all are demonic as fuck. A lot of you guys really aren't shits. Y'all ain't shit to the core. And it's like women can literally see exactly who you are because look the veil is lifted everybody is being revealed who they really are is coming to the forefront so you demonic motherfuckers you witchcraft motherfuckers yeah these women see right through you the veil is lifted so all that <laughs> like you're a good person no they're seeing the awful shit about you that's what the age of aquarius is right the revealing of who everyone really is to the core to the spirit to the soul so a lot of you demonic ass niggas are starting to realize that nobody really likes you no women really like you unless they're demonic and they ain't shit just like you right a lot of you guys are starting to experience that women really don't like you and you can see that they really don't like you they may not say it but they'll show it in their actions they'll show it by the way they treat you right and if you're a demon you're intuitive you can pick up on energies frequency vibrations like an angel can you can tell if somebody really likes you or not. So a lot of you demonic motherfuckers are experiencing the truth about how women really feel about you the whole time. Because they can't hide how they feel about you. They may not say anything, but you can feel it within your spirit that these women actually don't like you. And you know that these women can see you for who you really are. So a lot of demonic people are getting exposed. A lot of women and men are starting to see the angel in people. Right? They're starting to see who the angelic beings are. They're starting to see who's demonic motherfuckers. So a lot of people are drifting away from the demonic wicked motherfuckers because these motherfuckers have been hiding how wicked they really are. And the wicked shit that women are starting to pick up on these demons, they are drifting away. They don't want no parts of your horrible ass. That's the truth. So a lot of you demonic motherfuckers who was putting on a smile in the age of Pisces, right? Smiling in front of women, right? Hey, baby. What's good? Like you're an innocent person, they're starting to see the monster in you. They're starting to see how awful and treacherous and wicked you really are. And they're starting to despise your dumb ass on God. They are starting to hate your existence the more that they look at you because they can't unsee what they're seeing in you anymore. At first they couldn't see. The age of Aquarius is about hiding shit. The age of Pisces is about hiding shit, right? So you demons, could hide who y'all are y'all could hide the wicked shit y'all could hide how wicked and evil you really are but now women especially during these times spiritual or not is looking at men all everywhere and seeing them for exactly who they are and what these women are seeing in these goddamn demons is nah you ain't shit right so i love the age of aquarius because it's about the truth It's about the truth. So everyone is getting exposed. And when I say everybody, I mean everybody, right? Nobody can hide who they really are, right? It doesn't matter what type of smile you put on in front of people. Women and men can literally see through that facade. So no one cannot hide. It doesn't matter if you're spiritual. It doesn't matter if you're uh, not spiritual. You will be able to see everybody for who they are to the soul, to the spirit. So demons, angels, humans are getting revealed. Um, men women can see who the demons are and who the angels really are right so you demons right if you a demonic motherfucker watching this trust and believe everybody can see you and uh nine times out of ten they probably really don't like you they probably hate your existence get what i'm saying
They can see how awful of a motherfucker you really are to the soul, to the spirit. Women can too. So a lot of you demonic motherfuckers are starting to realize that nobody really likes you like you thought, right? The illusion is over. The veil is lifted. The way somebody feel about you, you gonna know. I don't give a fuck if you're spiritual. I don't give a fuck if you ain't spiritual. You'll know how somebody really feels about you. You'll feel it because that's what the age of Aquarius is about. Cold truth. So, I'm gonna wrap this shit up, man. Get with women who like you. All right? Get with women who like you. All right? Stop wasting your time with women who don't like you. If she don't like you right now, level up, see if the bitch like you. If she don't, fuck it. You'll get new hoes who really do like you. Simple. Y'all can't be stressing over women. Y'all can't be stressing over women. You cannot have any fucking more. So with that being said, I love you guys so much. Stay tuned for more content. And yeah, dog, 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 gang.